guys. Today's bits of peace is about the saint of the day, St. Louis, not the city, even though the city is named after him, but the saint, St. Louis, who happened to be a king of France. Now, there were 17 kings of France, but only one of them became a saint. So we're talking about St. King Louis the Ninth. He didn't become a saint because he was rich or famous, even though he was, but he became a saint because of how good he was. Louis the Ninth became king when his father, King Louis the Eighth, died. He was only 12 years old, and so he asked his mother to help him rule the country until he became an adult. And his mom taught him many things that helped him become a great king. She encouraged him to go out into the kingdom and get to know the people. And when he realized that a lot of people in his kingdom were poor and had a hard time making even enough money to feed their family, he thought he had an idea. He said he had the palace cooks every day. He had them make 100 meals and he would take them out of the palace to the people um, and, and, you know, and, and, and pass them out to the people. And that was only the start. Not only did he do that, not only did he do that, but he didn't go back to the palace and have his cooks make him a big meal. But instead, he only ate what the people left over. So he could get to know what it really felt like to be poor, what it felt like to not have much. So, and they all liked him for that. So when he uh, grew up then, and when he got, got to be an adult, um, he was in command of the biggest army in the world at that time uh, in France. And he was one of the, one of the, he decided that he wanted to go to the Holy Land and, um, and uh, take the Holy Land back from the peop from some of the enemies of the country that had taken over the Holy Land. Okay? And the Holy Land is the land of Israel. So he actually led two crusades to the Holy Land. Um, neither one of them was successful though. And as a matter of fact, the second crusade that he um, that he led, he actually ended up dying um, because of, of a disease that he caught along the way. So he didn't become a saint because he was a great warrior. He became a saint because he was so good. And even the people that he met along the way on the Crusades, uh, many of them thanked him uh, for, bringing, uh, for bringing them good news and for helping them um, live a better life, even though they were their enemies. So that's St. Louis, um, and that's, uh, that's about it for today. So we can end by saying St. Louis. You know what to say? Say pray for us. Pray for us. St. <laughs> Rock. Pray for us. And Our Lady Queen of Peace. Pray for us. All right. Have a good day. Bye-bye.